Hi, this is Jody. Welcome to Northern Country Creations. And I just wanted to share with you, um, this is my personal journal that I'm working on. Uh, we have a cabin up north and I always journal, so I kind of um, decided to make a new one. And this is an altered book, although I widen the spine without cutting the spine off. So it was a little tricky and sorry I didn't film that, but it was just a trial and error. Um, but it's Dear Mrs. Bird. Um, we love birds and the title kind of fit uh, the theme of the journal. And so um, I uh, made this into um, our journal for the cabin. So um, this is decoupaged on here, a little chickadee, and this is actually an uh, old book page, and it has some of the words about a cabin and a dock and, you know, being on a deck and a boat and bare feet, and so this was kind of really cool. And then this is like a 3D dimensional um, adornment that I added on to it. And then this is just a little... Um, it's actually a um, fortune cookie thing that says, Always remember where you are going and never forget where you've been. Um, just kind of really cool. So I added that on there. And so here is the inside of the book. And then, so I put this page on there, Home. And this is all cabin themed, all up north. Um, uh themed book. So these are all book pages, nothing digital, nothing printed. Um, these are all from uh, gathered items. So here's a pocket, the robin. You fold it down and there's the robin. It's a little poem. Journaling card. Picture of an old cabin, old time. Our cabin is kind of red themed, uh, red checkered, buffalo checkered, so I kind of wanted to keep the same t type of theme. This is actually a book page out of a book from Minnesota, um, A Day on the Big White Fish, and so this is um, ice fishing, and then this is a poem about a chickadee, and so I kind of I kind of try to keep things all themed, um, and then so here's a, a game trivia card. Um, it's it's a game called Camp, so it uh, was really cool how all of the words are in there. And so I took this out. I gotta actually I'm gonna put a card stock on the back of that so I can make it a journal card. I didn't do that yet. And so uh, we'll flip through, and you know I have a little bit of things to finish with this, but um, some journaling cards, and this is a children's book page of a cabin. And so um, I can journal on it. So it's vintage. Really cool looking. And, um, okay, so believe it or not, this is a like a credit card um, advertisement that came in the mail. This is the envelope. I loved the paint swirls of that. And so I kind of just decoupaged on some uh, flowers and on the back. And so it's actually an envelope that I can stick some uh, photos in and or memorabilia in there and so that's what I did with that. There's just some journaling paper. Coffee and tea dyed. And um, fun and folly of camping. There's some vintage pictures of some kids and fascinating Niagara Falls. Minnesota. music it's themed so then this is a book page of a dragonfly I just love the the bright colors of it made it into a pocket Here's some journaling paper another camp fun fact and actually it says dragonflies so I always like I said I try to keep things all matching and flowing together when you have it on the page and boxer dog we have a boxer so I like that. That's a very vintage book. 
And then this is a flip out. Um, we have a very much love for loons. And so this is um, a big um, fold out picture of, uh, of loons. And this is, um, oh, I can't remember what this is called. Uh, um, I can't remember what that's called for that game. Um, but I have a whole tablet of that. It's kind of old looking, and I love the red on the edges. Here's another one of the drawings um, of a bear. And, of course, here's a bear card and some more journaling paper. There's the other side of the dragonfly. And some white um, albino deer in, for, in Minnesota. There's the state page of Minnesota. This is a vintage fishing. I love vintage pictures. And this is um, one of those doilies, like for your restaurant or um, placemat. Um, I cut it into half. So, and that was nice red, so I picked that up. Put that in there. And here's some. Um, it's a cool journaling card I made. Different types of fish. We fish a lot. So it's a journaling card. And there's some paper, journaling paper. And of course there's another one of those cards about uh, fish. And then here's another one of those, little ones. And of course this is a little tuck spot with a, for a robin. And then I got the robin card matching there. Fun facts about robins. It's kind of fun for, it'll be fun for our grandchildren to go through and learn things, too. Here's the other half of the chickadee poem. Recipe card. Another camp card. And we love our swans. So here is a swan page with a poem. Pretty cool. And then on the back is leaves. more journaling paper. And of course there's a nice big fish, a pike, and then I found a camp card about the facts about fish for a pike. And then here's another one, a fun fact. Northern pike has been known to eat baby ducklings. Oh, so sad, but it's a fact. My state, and it talks about Minnesota. It's a bird. Here's a little tuck out, or pull out I mean, flip out. Um, talks about the trees. Chipmunk and squirrels. Gotta love them. They overtake your feeder sometime. Eagle. There's a pocket with some tea dyed papers to, for me to journal on. And I kind of left it a rough cut there. I kind of like that with the birch trees. Another pocket with some cards and some journaling paper. A little tab I made. It's uh, Minnesota Wildlife. It's a little cards, game cards, so I made a tab out of it, folded it in half, and it's pretty cool. So there's a little folder there, and there's some more wildlife pictures below. And there's some more pictures of wildlife, and some more journaling space, Monopoly money, the butterfly. There's a little butterfly tuck spot here, with a le uh, leaf picture there, and some more journaling paper. And then have um, another big journaling card that I decoupaged up and layered. So it's another big space. I made a curve, cut out curve there. This is a vintage fishing picture. And this one has um, some more journaling paper. I don't think I did I. Oh yeah, I did a little paper in there. And of course, Minnesota is the land of 10,000 mosquitoes. So here's a mosquito poem and a big old mosquito. And then I made it a, um, a band out of it, but then there's another one of those envelopes um, that I made up. Keep things in. I haven't done anything with this tab yet. And... Um, but I finished the card, and I just love our birds. So I'm not finished. I might put something there and then do something with my tag. So that's another journal card. Eagles. 
of course it's a um, hunting cabin as well so I have kind of archery and deer and there's elk those are all from different children's books there's a beaver there I haven't done anything with the inside of this yet and then um, there's a pocket and so I, it's just some journaling paper another fun fact card and then this is just an envelope and I think I have yep I got some Yahtzee paper in there so made that and tea dyed and coffee dyed paper and this is just a little flip down it's a poem about the lake cabin some more journaling paper vintage book pages again and I believe a lot of these vintage um, book these look vintage but they're from the book called reminisce I believe um, and I just love how they look there's a poem there a little inspirational thought and this was a cutout from a children's book and it's a big fish and I just love the bright colors and stuff so I just tuck that in there. I'll probably put something on the back and journal on it. Another journal card. Oh, it's a postcard actually. Um, is there a date on here? 1990. Some recipes out of a vintage cookbook. There's an eagle, a really old picture. More book pages, birds, more book pages, and then this little folder is actually an advertisement for chewing tobacco. Um, my husband happens to chew tobacco, and coupons came in this, and I thought, oh my gosh, this is so perfect to add to a junk journal. It's already made. It was, it was already made just like this, so it was perfect. I added it to the back page. And so I just added a couple journal journaling cards, and so there's another fun fact thing there, and that was so cool. And then I kind of made this uh, swan journaling card, and I put that on the edge there. So, and then this is the back page of the book. So, I love making the up north cabin uh, cottage you know, um, deer hunting cabin type books. I love doing these. I absolutely love, love, love doing this book. Um, this is my personal one. So, um, um, you, I can make more if anyone would like uh, me to make something like this. Um, so yeah, I love the wildlife ones. I have lots of wildlife books. Um, so there you go. And, um, be sure to check uh, my Amazon handmade, um, Northern Country Creations. I just started that. So, and um, so this is all new to me. So, thank you for watching.